How to make money on Cafe Press. Now this is the Cafe Press website and this is a print on demand store. Now if we take a look at this, let's take a look at some clothing and accessories. You can see that there are a bunch of t-shirts with different designs on them. And this is what print on demand is. So Cafe Press have all of these shirts ready and all you have to do is you have to upload designs like these and every time your design sells, you will get paid. So we've got this one, you only live once. You have a bunch of different shirts and the best thing to do is probably to niche down. Let's try and look at some funny shirts and as you can see these are very very basic. Now towards the end of this video I am going to show you how you can find these designs for yourself and how you can create them within two minutes. Now as I said the best thing about print on demand is once you have a few designs uploaded this can become completely passive income. Let's say that you uploaded these eight designs right here. You can just leave these up on your store. You do not have to touch them. You do not have to print these shirts. You do not have to deal with customer service. And every time one of these shirts sell, you will get commissions paid into your bank account. Now, it's not just t-shirts you can sell. If we go up here, you see that you can sell drinkware. So these are things like mugs, cups. I think that is a shot glass. And just look at this, guys. These are very, very simple to create. This one would be really good for beer drinkers. Coffee first, which is like one of those Starbucks mugs. I can imagine that these type of mugs sell extremely well. We have customized ones for different names. This one is Kimberly. We have a Bob Ross themed one, some dogs. And although these might seem like kind of random designs, like they are going to be hard to come up with. Trust me, guys, this is super, super easy. And if you put in around about an hour a day, you will be able to get up 20 designs and get them selling. So you can do t-shirts, you can do mugs, you can do... You can do blankets, pillows, shower curtains, rugs, pillowcases. The possibilities with print on demand are literally endless guys. And that's why it is personally one of my favorite business models. So once you have had a look through guys and you understand what sort of things you can sell, I mean, you can even sell greeting cards. What you want to do is you want to come up here and click create your own. Now, as you can see here, design your own custom products, customize our most popular products. So their most popular ones are t-shirts, pajamas, face masks, tote bags, baby bodysuits, and these mugs. So I'm just going to go for the bog standard t-shirt. You have a wide variety of t-shirts here. This one looks really cool. So this is going to be the one that I will select. So now you can go ahead and choose your color. Any of these looks pretty cool. I'm just going to stick with this one. And then in here, guys, this is where you can add your custom design. Now that sounds awesome. That sounds easy. But where are you actually going to A, find and B, create your design? Now, in the next part of this video, that is what we are going to be covering. So step number one is to actually find a design that you want to create. And there are a few websites to do this. Now, the first website is Redbubble. And this is another print on demand website, which is pretty similar to Cafe Press. However, Redbubble has a lot more designs, meaning a lot more competition. But let's go to clothing and see what can pop up. So let's look at t-shirts and tops. And then you can see all of these cool t-shirts. Now, some of these are looking a little bit complex. What we want to do is we want to go for simple and easy to create ones. For example, this one looks very cool. This is very easy to create. We have this one, a Grim Reaper riding a cart, and we have a bunch more t-shirts that you can take inspiration from. So I'm just going to select one from this website, which is here, and I am going to leave this open. Now, website number two that you can use is probably one that you have all heard of, and this one is called Pinterest. Let's try game gaming tea instead and as you can see this is a lot more of what we are looking for and you can see that anybody who is interested in gaming is probably going to be children that are wearing these but you can also look at these and you can get more inspiration now pinterest is probably the best website for you watching this video if you are a beginner as the designs are a lot simpler and easier to create and especially these sort of designs where the majority of its text or these ones where it's text and just a few little pictures of remote control controllers. These are so, so easy to create and I will show you how to do that. However, before we do that, I did forget to mention that you can just use the Cafe Press website itself to get some inspiration. You can see that these designs are the most simple out of all of them. The majority of these are just text. You've got this yin yang. This is so, so simple, guys. Let's see if we can see how many sales this had made. Okay, we can't, but guys, creating a design like this is literally one of the easiest things you have ever done.
done. Now for a shirt like this, all you would have to do is go to Google, search for Yin Yang, I think that's the name of it, and then you could literally just find the PNG image, just like this, save it to your computer, and then literally as simple as this guys, open image, and then we can add it to this shirt. Now I want to center this, center it, review, and then look at that guys, that is how simple it is to create a design like that. But I'm pretty sure that you guys want some more, not complex designs, but you want some designs like this, that actually have a bit of flair, they have something to them, and they are not just very basic like this. Now if you are just starting, maybe I would recommend doing things like this. With a design like this, it is just so easy to create, and you can get the first 50 t-shirts out on your store pretty much instantly. But if you do want some real designs and you want to know how to do this properly, you can use this website called Canva. Okay, so once you are on Canva, what we can do, and we are going to go for custom size and make this 1080 by 1080. Okay, and then create a new design. And then you can see right here, we have the Canva that we are going to create this design on. So we are getting inspiration from this. So we need a picture of a penguin. And to get this, you want to come to elements and in here type in penguin, penguin. And let's choose one that looks cool. So we can go for this penguin here, a happy little penguin, just like that. And then underneath this, we are also going to get some uh, spaghetti, just like this. Okay, and we can add them both in there, just like that. Put that up a little bit, put that up a little bit to cover his feet, so he's just poking out of the top. And then underneath, we are going to add some text. What did they say? Penguini Linguini. And if we can get a font that kind of looks like spaghetti, it's probably <laughs> it's probably going to be a little bit hard. We just got Penguini Linguini. And we want to make this a similar color to this pasta right here. So we add it just there. Okay. And I think that looks pretty awesome. If we move this up a little bit, center it all together a little bit more. And then we can make this a little bit bigger, just like that. And you can see guys that we took inspiration from this design. We did, we definitely didn't copy it. It doesn't really look anything like. All we did was we took inspiration. We created our own design. And then what we can do now is we can actually go ahead and download this. Make sure this has a transparent background, guys, which is another reason that you need Canva the free trial. And then we can go ahead and download this. Once you have done this, all you have to do is go back over to Cafe Press and you can upload this design on your t-shirt. From here, all you have to do is rinse and repeat this method over and over again to get as many t-shirt designs as possible. The more you get, the more you will earn. Now, making money with Cafe Press is an awesome way to make money online. However, in my opinion, the best way to make money online is through a business model called affiliate marketing. Now, this is what I did, and in my first month, I made $7.2,000. If you want to learn exactly how I did this, you can click the first link down in the the description. I made a video and I will tell you more about it. Now that is how you can make money with Cafe Press. Thank you for watching.